start. So to begin with, parkour is about efficiency. It's about how you look at an environment. In essence, parkour is about getting from one obstacle to the next. And the two fundamentals of parkour are reaching or free running at its essence, moving in unique ways and showing a style. So why do people do parkour? Mostly for the fun of it. I look into the, the emotional side of it and also the fundamental side of it because what I like about parkour the most is you get to figure out things about your body that you wouldn't normally experience doing any other exercise. What motivates me to do parkour is mostly that the physical and mental benefits out of it. You know, the people that you meet through parkour are always friendly, they're always kind. To do parkour, it's a mental game more than anything. Everyone has their own limits of what they can do, but the only thing stopping them is their mental attitude. When you're experienced in parkour, you can just tell when someone's trying to show off and they don't actually have the skill. I think a big thing about parkour and the public eye is that it's associated with um, criminal activity in a way because it's outside of the norms of moving. So I've been doing parkour for about three years, officially through classes, but before that I've probably had five to six years of experience. And what I've learnt in that time is my only limits are what I can see someone else do and then reaffirming my mental attitude to something. Limits in parkour are set mentally more. If you teach yourself, your free running will be much better than anyone else because when you're taught by a professional, you're learning how they move and you're not really discovering how you move deep within yourself. I consider parkour quite a safe sport because the biggest factor that holds you is if someone else can't do it, it can easily stop you from training that. Someone who's just starting is, is very stuck in specific ways of moving. Parkour trains you to be agile and to be, begin to move not just your legs, but also your arms in unison. The only fear that I see in parkour is when you're trying to do something bigger or something uh, more challenging than what you've done before. Because once you've done something, you, you know that you can always repeat that action. Parkour is really for anyone if they're willing to have a mindset of breaking down boundaries, dissolving mental barriers, and liberating themselves from the confines of our Western society. Ha <laughs>